What is up everybody and welcome back to more Let's Play Pixelmon. So when we last left off we were doing, we were shiny hunting actually, but, um, and also this time just before I get everything started, I did catch two kind of cool Pokemon, I just saw them while wandering around, so they're both pygmy version, actually are you a pygmy version? So I just saw them, yeah, so I saw them while walking around them and they just looked so cool, I, th I think p pygmy Pokemon are so cool. So they're both pretty simple to catch, so it's a Pharaoh and a Needle Rand female, and I don't plan on really using them, it's just kind of a cool pokemon to have i thought because they looked really cool and i can't land this this thing sucks can i return it um oh okay guess not i can't withdraw oh wait no i was trying to withdraw you but um yeah so i thought that and look how tiny this thing is it's just it's ridiculously tiny if we got a close-up there and oh that's actually kind of cool that's a cool picture <laughs> I should have took that picture, but I didn't. Oh well. Better luck next year. But, um, yeah, so, I thought they were cool, and, um, yeah, that's pretty much that. So, what we can do now is put that back, hit O again, and what I wanted to do today was go fossil hunting. So, obviously, I didn't, oh yeah, there's a wall now. Um, yeah, I don't know, there's, there's, it's a wall. There's not much to say about it. Um, so, we are probably going to run into some higher level Pokemon as we go down into the deep dark, deep dark depths of the bat cave so i figured i should probably bring some better pokemon so i'm just gonna bring dragonite as um, i'm sure he could handle whatever's down there and then i'll just leave some spots open actually here i'll, I'll i guess i'll bring someone with experience shares actually no because that's cheap so i'll just bring this team uh, a bunch of randoms almost all my shinies in one team and then dragonite who is my pseudo legendary so that's kind of cool and uh, yeah, so I get I did get a shovel and I enchanted it. Uh, I got Unbreaking three. I had one diamond, so and then I just got a few levels from mining various things. As you can see, there's some of the coal, which is the remnants. Uh, did I say that right? Remnant? I don't know. And uh, smelting also gives you levels. I don't have any coal left though. So yeah, I don't know. Let's go uh, go on an adventure. I mean, we do have a big ocean right over here, and we could just fly out really fast and pick a spot and dig. I mean, uh, I don't think there's a much better way to go about doing it. And the only problem is I can't see anything. So we can. Oh, did I just glitch out and uh, get moved around a little there? I think I did. So I'm trying to find a good place to actually enter it. Okay, this is a horrible place. To, is that wood? Wait a second. No, this is an awesome place. Dig faster. Dig with the unbreaking thing. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh, there you go. So <laughs> I was like, oh no, I'm gonna die. But actually, you break these faster with swords. So uh, yeah, it seems like a good spot, or as good a spot as any at least. And um, yeah, I don't know. Um, so now we gotta dig. And I'm, I'm not going to film all of it, obviously, because that would be counterproductive, but I may as well film some of it, and um, as I'm sure some of you would like to see it for whatever reason, and, oh, alright, oh wait, no, that's grass, I think, not gravel. God damn it, are we still in this whole uh, thing, debacle? So here, let's use you to craft this, and I'm dying, I'm dying, craft one sandstone and save me. Oh crap, don't die. Okay, that was a close one, <laughs> close call. And uh, where's the rest of this goddamn water coming from? Seriously, go away, water. Go away. No one likes you. No one likes you. And I think if I put this there. Is it going down yet? No. Where's it still coming from? Oh, damn it. Over here as well. Now it should go down. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So, oh, God. It's coming out of there, too. I can't see anything. So it made it um, 10 times harder to uh, navigate. And all right, that's just a giant hole. That's what she said. Um, but yeah, that's that's just a not fun. So I guess we'll go this way. Oh god, this is gonna be a nightmare. Um, I don't have. I need an enchanted pickaxe. I should probably almost try and go get one of those. Yeah, this is kind of getting ridiculous in here. And hmm. So I guess I could go just dig down this way because obviously if I keep digging the sand things will just go very very bad and um, Yeah, so here I gotta what I gotta do is block this and then I'll be a-okay So let's try and do that and all right. Uh, I need a block that I could actually fudge in place and um, There you go Now I can see Okay, and everything is visible now. So now we dig until we find some coal. No, till we find the stuff that um, you need to find fossils in. So ideally, if we found a cave, that would be the best bet, as I think a cave is, you know, obviously that's where you find stuff. I mean, 
where you find fossil -y stuff. So I think the best level is around where I'm at now. So here, let me check my level. So I am at 39. So yeah, I think that is the best level to actually search for fossils. So hopefully we could stick around here. And uh, yeah, hopefully we do actually find something. I do want a Rampardus, and even that that uh, turtle dude. I know he's in the he's from Gen Five, I think, but he's in the game, so he'd be kind of cool. And even that flower thing, I remember getting that back in the day while playing actually playing Leaf Green. So uh, that would be kind of cool to have one of them. And here's some bauxite ore that I really don't need. I have 40 of it, so I'll just leave it to be for now. And it's not really useful. Well, I guess it is, but I don't I don't have a use for it because everything that it's useful for is um, provided free at Swan. So, yeah, I mean, we are just going to dig aimlessly. I'll come back if anything exciting happens. So I will see you all then. OK, so oh God, I just hit my mouse. Um, so the very first uh, patch of gravel, if we get it on this one, uh, I did that once before, didn't I? Yeah, so if we get it on this one, I will be ecstatic. We're not going to get it on this one. Actually, are we still in the ocean biome? We're in plains, so we're not getting it. Wow, I'm kind of stupid. So, I mean, I guess we could dig and check either way, but yeah, I don't think we'll get any thing from here. Uh, no fossils to be found, so I guess I'll have to uh, get out of here and switch my direction, because clearly I'm not in the ocean anymore. Um, so I may as well, since I'm here though, at least uh, destroy all the gravel and hope for the best. Is my sound off? Yeah, it is. I was going to say, I can't hear anything. So we can do that, and we could hear some stuff now. So yeah, we'll just continue digging, digging, digging. I, I don't see anything, although they are dark, so I mean, they're definitely not difficult to miss. You could totally miss a fossil on accident and not even realize it. So we can continue like so, and just dig, 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 and I don't see it. I mean, it's obvi it's a block, obviously, so it would be behind some of these. And uh, yeah, so it looks like we're just gonna have a whole bunch of gravel again, and not much to do with it. So let's see if we dig that. Imagine it was just right there in the last block. Uh, we mined again. That's what happened once, um, as I have a sneeze and I'm fighting it off. Uh-oh, but uh, I'll come back, so yeah. Okay, so round two, this is uh, not far at all, but uh, we actually found more, and uh, this time we actually have, uh, this one is in the ocean. So this one has potential, obviously I'm not going to show all of these, I'll show a few, what the hell is that, okay. Um, so I'll show, oh it's saving the level, yeah I should probably, I'll come back when I mine more. Just kidding, I've saved. So, uh, yeah, so basically, I don't think, uh, this one, I mean, the odds of us finding a fossil on this are very, very slim, so I'm sure I'll cut out a bunch of this, as I don't think you guys want to watch me looking for a fossil. I mean, it doesn't seem very fun to me uh, to just watch me standing here digging, 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 and then, uh, you know, doing that. It doesn't, not what I would want to watch, but hopefully my voice is the, uh, you know, whipped cream to your smooth what that didn't make any sense hopefully you like my voice as um that's kind of i think what a lot of youtube is about now anyway but anyway the new pixelmon update who's excited for that i'm still waiting for that to come out uh they're taking their sweet time i don't know they said we're almost nearly there like three weeks ago so i don't know i guess nearly there means different things for different people but uh, yeah so let's go take another route and we'll see where we end up so I actually managed to find a ravine at this point, and also someone was gracious enough, I was talking about it a little bit in chat, and so I got efficiency now on my shovel as well, so that's nice, but my pickaxe is about to break, so we may have to go ask for some help on that, but as you can see, the shovel is just masterwork, uh, if anyone remembers that from that game that had masterwork, uh, what was that? Was it, I want to say Fable, but I don't know. But uh, yes, yeah, so we found a ravine. I mean, obviously, this is uh, going to make things a little bit easier. Not nearly as much mining and a lot more digging and such. So um, ho this shovel will probably get some wear and tear now. But it does have a breaking three. So that makes it really good. And it is really fast. So, But I don't know how common... I've never found uh, a fossil in a ravine. So I don't know if they're like rare in there or... I, I don't know. So... So I don't think you could actually find them in ravine, so maybe you can, but I'm guessing not, because ravine generation is kind of like different than, I thought that was one I was about to flip out, uh, ravine to like generate, you know what I mean, like they kind of generate differently than uh, like ocean. So what I'm going to do now is actually switch out of the ravine and go to a different 
place and or just like start here and start mining this way instead as i think that's better i just think like because ravines are like a unique feature already i think they're just generally spawn under ocean so i will start mining this way uh there's a cave um i guess you could probably could check this no i don't know i don't see anything right off the bat um here's obviously a thing are we still in the ocean biome yes we are so I don't see anything, but again, I'm going to just continue uh, mining this. I actually had to start deleting. I, I found a... Oh, crap. So here, we have a gold bat. We could watch the fight. I actually had to fight one already, but uh, I, I started having to... I threw a stack, or I think... No, two stacks of um, gravel in lava already because it was just... I don't know. It's getting too much. I, I have more than enough inventory space, but it was just getting... My inventory was no, so neat, and now it's getting cluttered, so I don't even know how much I have on me now because that was a little while ago. But, um, yeah, so just digging away fine and dandy. This is how you find fossils. You got to get your hands dirty, and, um, yeah. Oh, crap. I didn't want to do that. I really didn't want to do that. Um, well, I guess you could kind of say now it's like it's like a filter. It's filtering all the water, and you could almost check most places um, just by, like, destroying the blocks and having them fall there. But I kind of, like, wanted to make be extra safe and actually destroy everything but hello charizard you could come back and um where is this coming from i kind of want to swim up there god damn it why is water in minecraft so annoying like seriously um so let's patch this hole up a little bit and or we could just not get that to work at all and i just need one block right there right there if it wants to let me swim up there Okay, maybe a few more than one. I thought it was one. Maybe not. Come on. Oh my god. God damn it. Alright, this is not working. Here, let me come on. Get up there. Stop swimming or stop why do you have to be like this, man? Why can't you just be like normal water? <laughs> um, I guess that's too simple. Oh my god, alright, forget it, forget it, forget it. Um okay, I'll be back when I find one, hopefully try that so i have good news and i have bad news the good news is i found a fossil so i almost didn't find it and that's the funny part like there was actually just i dug out a whole uh, like little thing right there and i didn't almost i was walking away and i turned back around for whatever reason i noticed the hole so there's a whole like secondary spawning of all this stuff for down here so here it is the fossil beautiful i know i don't know what it is the funny part, or the weird story behind it is, the second I found the fossil, I didn't even get a chance to mine it. Like, I uncovered it, I destroyed the gravel, I got a bloody nose. Like, and I haven't gotten a bloody nose in, like, I don't know, when was the last time I got a bloody nose? It was, like, seven, eight months ago, nine months. It wasn't like, I, it's not like I get bloody noses. So, this is the cursed fossil, and I'm gonna destroy it. And then, now here comes the question, oh, crap, I have no room. <laughs> um, uh, what do I not need? You. So, here comes the question in the video. Do I keep the fossil, or since it's cursed, do I destroy it? So, uh, tell me in the comments below what you think I should do. I mean, I'm not one to be superstitious, but bloody noses, I mean, it drew blood from me. What the hell is this doing? Um, but yeah, it drew blood from me, this fossil, so, I don't know. So, tell me what you guys think I should do. I hope to see you all next time, and, uh, again, again, thanks for watching. Bye!